Good evening, everyone. My name is Mally Rosetto, and I'm the Council President for the Court of Common Council for the City of Hartford. I am calling to order this regularly scheduled Council meeting of Monday, May uh, 24th to order. For uh, those of you who are with us this evening, um, you can view this meeting through Hartford Public Access TV. Uh, Facebook Live, Channel 96 uh, through Comcast, and Channel 6032 uh, through Frontier. Uh, without further ado, uh, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? So, Woman Bermudez. Councilwoman Bermudez. She's saying present. I'm not hearing her. We're not hearing you. Okay. I did hear her. It was just like very, very low. So maybe okay. if you can move forward, Councilwoman Bermudez, we could probably hear. No. Oh. Mr. Clerk, if you continue the roll call, we'll come back to okay. Councilwoman Bermudez. Councilman Clark. Here. Councilman Gale. Here. Councilman LeBron. Present. Councilman Mitchum. Here. Councilwoman Rosado. Present. Councilwoman Rossetti. Councilwoman Rossetti. I'm here. Councilman Sanchez. Present. Councilwoman Surgeon. Here. You have a quorum. Thank you. Could we please uh, go back to Councilwoman Bermudez? Councilwoman Bermudez. Maybe she can just give us a thumbs up or thumbs down. Yes, thank you. Thank you, uh, Mr. Clerk. And now our town clerk will lead us to the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, uh, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Through you, I'd like to make the motion that we suspend uh, our agenda to add more on the following items. Item number 12, which will be the adoption of substitute General Fund Ordinance, item number 13, uh, which would be the adoption of the CIP Substitute Ordinance, and item number 14, which is the adoption of the Tax Levy Ordinance. I second the motion. A motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any of this? Councilman Mixtum. Just for clarification, it's a motion to suspend the rules? Yes, Discuss. it is. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Councilman. Are there any other discussions? Any other discussions? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mishdom. Yes. Councilwoman Rosado. Yes. Councilwoman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilwoman Surgeon. Yes. Motion passed. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Through you, I'd like to make a motion that we take action on item number 12, adoption of substitute general fund ordinance. I second the motion. Motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mitchum. No. Councilman Rosado. Yes. Councilman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilman Surgeon. Yes. I didn't hear Councilwoman Bermudez. No. Can you get can you guys hear me? No. Now, yeah. we, now yes. That was a nay, correct? Correct. Motion passed. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Through you, I'd like to make the uh, motion that we take action on item number 13, 
adoption of the CIP substitute ordinance. Second the motion. Motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? There be a none. Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mitchum. Yes. Councilman Rosado. Yes. Councilman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilman Surgeon. Yes. Motion pass. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Through you, I'd like to make a motion that we take action on item number 14, which is, a, which is the adoption of the tax levy ordinance. I second the motion. Motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? Councilman Gale. Just very quickly, we'd like to note for the public that there's no mill rate increase built into this budget, that the mill rate has remained uh, the same. In fact, it's the same mill rate um, for, I think, the last 10 years. Thank you. Thank you, Councilman Gale. Any other discussion, comments? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez? Yes. Councilman Clark? Yes. Councilman Gale? Yes. Councilman LeBron? Yes. Councilman Mitchum? Yes. Councilwoman Rosado? Yes. Councilwoman Rossetti? Yes. Councilman Sanchez? Yes. Councilwoman Surgeon? Yes. Motion passed. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Through you, I'd like to make a motion that we place on the consent calendar item number nine, which is a resolution, <clears throat> excuse me, resolution to appoint Amanda Detmer to the UBI task force. Second the motion. The motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mitchum. Yes. Councilwoman Rosado. Yes. Councilwoman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilwoman Surgeon. Yes. Motion pass. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Through you, I'd like to make the motion that we that we receive uh, the following item, item number 11, which is Mayor Bronin, communication concerning financial resolutions adopted by the council on May 19th, 2021, Democratic Party financial resolution number one, Democratic Party financial Resolu resolution number two, Hartford Party financial resolution number one. I second the motion. A motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? Councilman Gale. Yeah, thank you, Madam Chair. I just uh, wanted to note that as a result of this communication, that tax levy did stay the same. And I just wanted to add that I think the sentiment of every single person on this, uh, on this council is that we would love to do something to reduce that mill rate. Um, uh, and it has been a source of, of great dismay for everyone that it has remained so high for so many years. Thank you. Thank you, Councilman Gale. I share those same sentiments. Co Councilman Mixtum. For, forgive me, I just didn't hear. Which number on our agenda is this? I want to make sure. I'm... Item number 11. Okay, that's what I thought. I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss something. Thank you, Councilman Mixtum. Uh, are there any other discussions? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mitchum. Yes. Councilman Rosado. Yes. Councilman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilman Surgeon. Yes. Motion passed. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. I yield my time to Councilman Sanchez. For the record, you're yielding your time uh, to Councilman uh, Sanchez for the referred items. And through you, uh, Madam President and Majority Leader, um, I'd like to uh, make a motion to refer the following items to OMBGA 
Item number one, uh, Mayor Bronin with the uh, company resolution authorizing the city of Hartford and the Hartford Police Union to enter into an agreement to address in part the significant disparity in pay between the city of Hartford and other cities and towns throughout Connecticut, which has contributed to retention challenges for the Hartford Police Department. Item number two, uh, Mayor Bronin with a company, company resolution authorizing the annual submission of the list of community programs eligible for the 2021 Connecticut Neighborhood Assistant Act, NAA, uh, tax credit program to the Connecticut Department of Revenue Services, DRS. Also, and, and that will be a hearing date of June 21, 2021. Um, item number three, Mayor Bronin with the accompanying resolution approving the HUD annual action plan for the program year uh, July 1, 2021 to June 30, 2022. The annual plan outlines the city's intended use in year two of approximately $6.7 million in the title mid funds for activities funded through the CDBG, ESG, HOPWA, and HOME programs. And that hearing date is June 21, 2021. And also item number four, uh, Mayor Brown is with a company resolution authorizing the city to enter into contractual agreement with Parkville Senior Center for the operation of the Parkville Senior Center and Catholic Charities for the operation of the Hispanic Senior Center. I second the motion. Motion has been uh, made. Uh, Councilman uh, Sanchez for clarifications uh, could you please read again the hearing dates for item number two and item number three? So the hearing date for item number two is June 21st, 2021. And also number three is June 21st, 2021. I believe the hearing dates for item uh, hearing for item number two, the hearing date is June 10th. Mr. Clerk, could you verify that? That is correct. And for item number three, the hearing date is June 17th. That is correct. Okay. okay. And for item number five is June 21st. Correct. Okay. Um, are there any, a motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Councilwoman Rossetti. Uh, for the record, I need to recuse myself from uh, uh, agenda item three. Which is the CDBG? CDBG. Thank you. Mr. Town Clerk, did, did you hear uh, Councilwoman Rossetti recusing herself from CBUG? Yes, I have that. Thank you. Okay. Um, Councilman Clark. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, for the record, uh, I need to recuse myself from item number six. Are there any other discussions? Any other discussions? I'd like to call a point of order. Uh, Mr. Clerk, could you please verify for the record one more time the hearing dates for item number two and three? I received a text message. Yes, the hearing date for item number two is June 10th. Hearing date for item number three is June 17th. Thank you so much. There being no other questions or concerns, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes, with the exception of number six. Thank you. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Bishop. Yes. Councilwoman Rosado. Yes. Councilman Rossetti. Yes, with the exception for uh, number three. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilman Surgeon. Yes. Motion pass. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Mr. Majority Leader, you have the floor. Thank you, Madam President. Uh, through you, I'd like to make a motion that we postpone the following items. Item number seven, an ordinance amending chapter two appointments of department heads requirements, section 850 residency requirements of the municipal code. And item number eight, substitute ordinance amending chapter 27 itinerant vendors, food vendors, and food trucks of the Hartford municipal code. I second the motion. 
Motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? Councilman Sanchez. Yes, I still have uh, three more items to refer. Mr. Majority Leader. Um, I yield if, if that's the case. Well, can we- okay. can Let's we... just run the motion on this one and we'll go back to Councilman Sanchez. Sanchez yes. Are there any other discussions? Any other discussions? There be a none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? And this is the motion to postpone item okay. seven and eight. Yes. Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mitchum. Yes. Councilman Rosado. Yes. Councilman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilman Surgeon. Yes. Motion pass. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. Ms. Council Sanchez, you have the floor. <laughs> okay. Um, I'd like to make a motion to refer the following items to uh, PDH, uh, Planning, Economic Development and Housing. Item number five, uh, uh, Mayor Brown is with accompanying resolution authorizing the transfer of 11 city owned properties to the Hartford Land Bank as part of their lot next door program. And item number 10, uh, resolution that the Court Common Council urges the closure and decommissioning of the Brandon Airport and that the city of Hartford reclaim the 201 acres of land for more beneficial, environmentally friendly economic development for all residents. I second the motion. A motion has been made and properly second. Uh, for the record, uh, Mr. Clerk, could you please uh, mention the items that are being referred? The items that are being referred, um, and this is the second referral motion by Councilman Sanchez is items number five and 10. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. There's a public hearing date for, for number five. Yes, yes. June 21st. Correct. Are there any other discussions on this motion? Any other discussion? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. Yes. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mitchum. Yes. Councilwoman Rosado. Yes. Councilwoman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilman Surgeon. Yes. Motion passed. Thank uh, you, Mr. Clerk. I don't believe we have mentioned item number six. I, I'm about to mention that now. You have the floor, Councilman Sanchez. Thank you, through you, Madam Chair. Um, I'd like to make a motion to refer item number six to Health and Human Services, HHS. Uh, Mayor Bronin with accompanying resolution authorizing the City of Hartford Department of Health and Human Services to receive $1.9 million in funding and execute contracts and contract amendments with the State Department of Public Health through its BEPF program, which is funding vaccine outreach in cities across the state. I second the motion. Motion has been made and properly second. Are there any discussions? Any discussions? There being none, Mr. Clerk, could you please call the roll? A clarification from Councilman Clark. You earlier stated you want to excuse yourself from item six. That is correct. correct. I still okay. still need to excuse myself from item number six. Thank you. Councilwoman Bermudez. Yes. Councilman Clark. I recuse myself. Excuse. Councilman Gale. Yes. Councilman LeBron. Yes. Councilman Mishtim. Yes. Councilman Rosado. Yes. Councilman Rossetti. Yes. Councilman Sanchez. Yes. Councilwoman Surgeon. Yes. Motion passed. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. I do believe that concludes our uh, business for this evening. I want to take a moment um, to thank our Corporation Council, Howard Rifkin, uh, Hartford Public Access TV, uh, our Town Clerk, uh, along with Eric, uh, Lusa, and Sixto Lasso for the wonderful work that they've done uh, to the administration and all departments. Uh, I also enjoyed uh, through this uh, budget process, my conversations with the Hartford party and with the working party 
uh, looking forward to a uh, follow up on our conversations in the best interest of all of the residents of the city of Hartford. Um, so with that said, thank you everyone for the outstanding work and this meeting's adjourned. Good night. Good night.